Hi there, Rob Rayner here. Welcome to the first edition of Hot House on the website. I just want to uh, explain what this is and then we'll get into the first property. Hot House uh, is something that I'm going to do on a weekly basis. I'm going to identify properties that I feel are undervalued for today's market and I'm going to tell you about them. Now, they're not necessarily properties that I have listed. I'm not going to just do it exclusively for listings of mine, but any listing in my market area that I feel is undervalued, I feel is a real buy right now, I'm going to tell you about it. And then if you're interested in it, we can go from there and investigate and see if it's going to work for you. I'm going to cover properties that range from uh, high-end executive homes, which uh, there will probably be a lot of those in the hot house area right now, and even uh, starter and investment properties because there's a few that uh, really have feel, feel the effects of the current market situation and could be great buys right now. So uh, let's dive into property number one. Uh, you can see it's up on the screen here. And the first thing I want to tell you is that the first property identified to do for my Hot House series went conditionally sold. And here it is. It's pending. It's listed at $489.9. This, to me, was a Hot House buy when it was at its previous list price right around the 500 mark. It had been on the market since before Christmas. Uh, even then, I felt it was undervalued. But no buyers were biting. The seller reduced the price again, and now they have a conditional sale. So, kind of funny that my first hot house buy that I identified a few days ago to bring to you is already conditionally sold. So the market identified it as a super buy as well, and that's the goal of this. Uh, just to give you an idea, though, uh, to, let's use this property as maybe a case study for some others that are in the area because there are some other houses that are priced in this range uh, that are similar, maybe not to this location extent, and that's why this was a great buy. Uh, this particular house had uh, a walking path down the left-hand side, had a great view of the big hill in Cochrane and the river, and had a very private yard in the lower walkout level. Uh, you can see it's about 1,500 square feet, had uh, two bedrooms on the main and another two down, uh, lots of bathrooms in the place. Uh, probably what uh, what really held this one back is probably it was a little bit challenged from a color scheme standpoint. Uh, it's very basic inside, basic flooring, basic kitchen, and had uh, really every color on the palette inside. Uh, again, that's all cosmetic stuff, and that's why this house kept dropping in the market is because the buyer doesn't have the appetite for cosmetic stuff right now with everything that's out there. They want it all done and fresh and clean. You know, that's why this turned out to be a terrific buy for somebody. So again, 202 Bull Ridge Court was my hot house for the week. It's already conditionally sold, but watch next week and I'll bring you more. Now, if you want to comment on any of this, I'd love to hear from you. Or if you think you know a hot house, give me an email, info at robrainer.com. That's R-E-Y-N-A-R, info at robrainer.com. Thanks a bunch and we'll talk to you again.